Now, we all know that, that film is a very powerful medium that can be used to entertain and educate, which is an experience celebrated by the annual Encounters Documentary Festival. Now, in its 20th edition, it showcases that the future of film is truly female. And we have guest director Ndate Reji Zamukolo Kanzi in studio uh, with us to share more on this very, very exciting year. Thanks for joining us. How are you, sir? No, I'm good. Very well. Thanks, Katlejo. And thanks for having me. And good morning to the viewers at home. Excellent. So let's talk about the uh, fact that the, uh, the, the Encounters Film Festival is celebrating uh, a very special anniversary, 20 years now. And uh, the fact that more than 50% of the films that will be shown there um, are directed by females, which is, I think, a very progressive step. Well, uh, firstly, let's say happy birthday to Encounters. Yes. And, you know, <laughs> and this... Milestone, 20 years is really a long time. Mm -hmm. uh, ala ala encounters, ala ala. ala, ala. Uh, look, there's never going to be an opportune time to showcase um, women work, right, in the documentary genre because um, it's a male dominated uh, genre. And uh, we felt that 20 years from now, you know, 50 years from now, if we don't take the initiative, who is going to do that? Mm -hmm. So. It's stories that are told by women about women, you know. So that's 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 what we've decided to do. Yeah, yeah. And there are there are very striking stories that, that'll be told by women. Uh, some of them focusing on women. Take me through some of your favorites that you'd like to have our attention on. Okay. Well, uh, obviously the highlight of our fa film festival this year is, uh, you know, the presence of uh, Matangi, you know, uh, who is MIA, who you guys know her as Maya. Mm -hmm. Right, um, so she has come a long way from being, you know, an immigrant teenager in Sri Lanka to a London, you know, um, pop sensation and rap artist. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, Maya is very unconventional in that she's a kind of a in your face, you know, uh, activist, uh, you know, uh, who's also very unaware of the platforms that she can use to express her political beliefs. Mm -hmm. So she'll also be singing here. You know, she's got a concert at the old uh, Biscuit Mill in Cape Town on the 7th, mm -hmm. and then uh, at the Newtown uh, Music Factory on the 8th. Excellent. So, uh, yeah, and, pe and if people do come to her screenings, then uh, two tickets, you know, are going to be won. Uh -huh. Yeah, but you must come. Yeah, <laughs> but you must come. Mm -hmm. the, the other highlight that we have is obvious is, 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 is of uh, Vivian Westwood, mm -hmm. right? I'm sure you guys know her as a fashion designer, but uh, the film that she's showing this year in our festival also portrays her as an icon, a punk activist, right? Um, and also a woman who has gone through a journey of self-discovery, mm -hmm. you know, like her fashion she's evolved, evolved the time. you know she hasn't like stood and and and, and had not done anything because mm -hmm. some people have feared her some have ridiculed her whilst others have admired her you know uh, and like pieces of her garments you know um the film takes bits and pieces from here and there past and present you know jumping through time you know backwards and forwards yeah, yeah. and really just stitching everything together so the film portrays her life. Mm -hmm. And then uh, one of the South African highlights that yes. we think is very, very important um, is a film called Standing on Their Shoulders by Polis mm -hmm. Now, this film looks at two generations of women, you know, the 1956 march to the Union buildings, mm -hmm. as well as, uh, you know, the uh, fallist movement. Uh, leaders, mm -hmm. but we, we were strictly looking at female here, who refuses really to be relegated to the status of, you know, uh, if there is not a man, we cannot lead. Mm -hmm. You know, because if you look at Mama Sophia, uh, the Brain Williams, for an example, you know, after the 1956 march, you could not hear much about her, you know what I mean? Because they all went into being a, a, a housewife and a mother to the kids, you know, but... Uh, in, 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 in the film itself, there's strong interviews, you know, from these female activists that are saying, look, even though the struggle by the ANC was led by men, mm -hmm. they could not have done it without women. Without women. You know, so, 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 so it portrays women as being independent from that, that they can actually do, you know, uh, 
their own work Absolutely. and actually become you know prominent in their own right oh, sounds very exciting uh, westwood madangi maya mia and standing okay. on their shoulders as some of those that we can look forward to thank you very much for joining us and of course you can see all of this at the 20th edition of the encounters documentary film festival which starts today and runs until the 10th of june screenings take place in johannesburg and in cape town across various venues so if you'd like more information make sure that you head on over to encounters.co.za to get your tickets